Hey guys, so today I am showing you my attempted twist and curl on this curly textured U part wig from Her Given Hair. Before I jump into styling, here's a quick clip just to show you guys the hair in its original state. It's a pretty thick unit with a mixture of 18 and 20 inches. I think it's 20 grams in weight and the texture is curly. It also comes with some wig combs as well as an adjustable wig fastener at the back. And some of you may even notice this unit from this video where I dyed it and styled it in three super quick and easy hairstyles. To get started, I've put my hair into some twists because I find this to be less manipulative than cornrows. I don't really have super dense hair so I can get away with having my hair like this when it's under a curly unit. Once all of my hair is pinned down, with the exception of my leave out hair at the front, I go on to tuck it away under a wig cap and then pop the unit on. To secure the unit onto my hair, I use the wig clips at the front. I'm usually not a fan of these because I find them to be quite painful and they also have the potential to pull out your hair. But these felt fine, I was really happy with them so I left them in. I also used the elastic fastener at the back to make sure the unit was super duper snug because nobody wants a flyaway wig. Once the wig is nice and secure, I unravel my leave out twists at the front and then the official styling process begins. To help blend the wig hair with my hair, I've already sprayed my hair with some water and the wig hair with some water, as well as applying some styling gel to both of them. This will help to give some extra hold. I can't remember the name of the gel, but I will put it in the description box for anyone interested. Once I finish twisting the section of hair, I then reach for my flexi rod and simply wrap the twist around it. And I do this across the entire wig unit. Some minutes later, this is what I'm working with. I've got all of my flexi rods in. And just to speed up the process of drying, I go under my hooded dryer for an hour and a half. One and a half hours later, it is time to take these bad boys down. My twists weren't 100% dry, I'd say 90% dry, but guys, you couldn't have paid me to spend another minute under that dryer. It was hot. I was so hot, I just, I just couldn't deal, honestly. So this is my hair. I was pretty impressed with the twist and curl definition at this point, but to finish things off and add a final touch, I did spray my edges with some water and apply some gel to my edges so that they could be laid and I let this set under my headscarf for 20 minutes. Whilst my edges were setting, as you do, I glammed up and by the time I was finished with my makeup, I was ready to take my hair down. The results were these juicy, shiny and bouncy curls, which I really did like. My one regret though was not dyeing the unit a black colour so that it would have blended better with my hair. I did feel like I could really tell the difference between my own hair and the hair on the unit. But other than that, the hair was great quality, it was soft, it held up really, really well. If you are looking for a protective styling unit or you want to switch things up with your hair, this is definitely a great option. Her Given Hair have great textures on their website and I put all of the wig information in the description box, so feel free to check that out. Till next time, thank you so much for watching. Bye.